Hello there. Welcome to the playoffs of Quarantine Cup number 105. We are yet again playing with the extra ally setting on our tables. I'm, I'm sitting on the top of the bracket facing off against Sean Han. <laughs> the, uh, on the other side, we have S. Sander fighting tracer um so we've got a <coughs> or a mason's like your top deck i oh, don't know no. it's the keep out of keep out of shuffle so like counterfeit and junk dealer both reasonable opens here puka really even is not not unreasonable i wouldn't say um Junkular Silver seems pretty good. Puka Silver also seems all right-ish, to be honest. Certainly it can be bad. I think any of the $5 trashers are reasonable. <coughs> Certain hands with Puka are pretty nice for Way of the Chameleon. Um... can do town as a um town with chameleon as some even more uh you get to dis uh, i guess we'll toss those two things did not <laughs> didn't particularly help us out here but shanahan goes with the junk dealer we have a kind of a sad shuffle here though it'll probably be okay-ish. Gotta think a little bit. I could try to just shuffle through well that wouldn't be particularly good. Um last card's a copper, so we can take Right, there are four jungles. So we can draw one and then um, chameleon and buy a junk dealer now. This is an exceptionally nice draw for me. I'm kind of, I don't really like Capital City as your first five here. I don't know. I don't know what it does for you. That's that nice. I guess it's not his first five. <laughs> I guess that that would explain it. Um, I think we just draw on, even though we may not have five. Yeah, it's good though. <coughs> Make take a develop at some point. <laughs> Capital City. Capital City chameleon stuff is pretty funny. Um we're gonna need buy, so at some point it makes sense to take a counterfeit. We have to get the gain somewhere, but I think it could be a develop. Um, I could just draw here, like chameleon draw it. So that has some pretty bad. What is our? Oh, that's emissary. Yeah, I would like to have an emissary. If we just draw and see. I mean, the alternative is we buy a, like a royal galley now. I guess we can buy five, actually. Um, kind of like an emissary before more villages. We can take a village here. I mean, no matter, I mean, assuming we saw the puka here, we were always going to have a, like a kind of a nice thing we could do here. Um, it would have been cool, of course, to see the junk dealer. 
think I'll take the capital city now. We're gonna get Finn. They've taken... I guess you can keep the... first gold around if you want. Get another capital city. It seems. No, they don't really have the. I don't really like these buys that much from Shanahan here. Oh, Tang, yeah. Because I guess the order here should be like. Well. Something like this. I don't know, there maybe is a, like a friendlier, it's not really, anything. we might as well, I, mean, I guess we can get two trashes if we, if we don't chameleon, so that makes some sense. Um, this sad part is drawing the counter, or the, whatever this is, the emissary. So we can have we can have a lot of money if we're willing to take a lot of curses. I'm not I'm not actually willing to do that, so um I might be willing to take one. I would like a develop. Yeah, I kind of like those. <clears throat> it could have been... What did I have without playing the um, Curse of Eyes on 6? 6 wasn't so appealing. I could have counterfeited the silver. I just, I just, I super don't care <laughs> for quarantine cup. He can go back, he can go back to the start of his turn if he wants. I think I'm probably a little bit ahead if I draw good enough here. They really need to develop, I think. They have all this stuff that isn't uh, particularly nice unless you get a little bit out of it. Um, I think I'll toss a the curse trash should be fairly easy. Probably looking at a Million to town. Do, do, do. Um, this is a little. This isn't the greatest order on my part because I didn't get the. I guess I don't have to. I was going to say I'm not getting emissary stuff, but I, I don't necessarily have to. Um, well, it would be better. Yeah, I kind of meant, well, it was somewhat just the bottom deck. <clears throat> I think I probably messed this up at least a little bit because I don't have a good way to draw what I'm getting here, which I would sort of like to do. Um, 
maybe worth it to keep the cursed gold around still. Uh, this has got to be either like Royal Galley. I mean, Royal Galley is a little bit scarier, though I am getting to order Mason some, so it's probably okay. Um, and then we just blow up the silver. Or are we going to have one, two, three, six, or we can blow up and get more. Let's, let's go higher and, and do play the Cursed Gold. Um... I won't get the second Royal Galley there yet. I maybe should have, but... Okay. Yeah, you can just toss, like, so much junk. Just do those two. It's probably okay for now. We may leave the... Well, this wasn't very good. <laughs> Guess I should have done. Some of the treasure too. Um, oh well. We may find like the first and two cards or I don't know. Didn't didn't work out super well. Well it may. We don't know what's on top yet. It may just be fine. Just the hand is scary. Um Certainly the hand is scary. Yeah, I probably should have tossed more. I mean, like, if I think I'm going to be activating emissary a time, every time, or, like, at least once a turn, then, uh... Using up this favor doesn't look that scary. Okay. This is... I mean, you gotta play on. We may just end up having to blow up something nice. <laughs> we didn't even get to any villages. This was the worst draw ever. <laughs> this was just the absolute nightmare draw. Uh, we could lose a counterfeit. I don't really like to, of course. Yeah, I mean, that's on me for not pulling more of the treasures out <clears throat> of the shuffle. I certainly should have. Still very sad. There's not even like a good. Eh, I don't love doing this, but it's really actually just super depressing. <laughs> um, I still like overdraw. I just think. You can do quite a bit with develop here. I don't know if we can lose a five easily. Uh, we could replace. I don't know. We also don't get to activate on this shuffle for the emissaries. That's okay. Um, I don't know exactly where Shanahan's deck is. Probably fine. Probably fine. I do wish. Yeah, that was rotten. Yeah, we should have pulled out Cursed Gold and like Counterfeit or Gold as well. Then it would have been like almost impossible to stop. You would have hit something. Or at least like Junk Dealer Curse. I don't know what the last card Like the last card is even another capital city, so. Um, yeah, that was a big bummer, but. <clears throat> I don't know if Shanahan. The counterfeit. Okay. Yeah, that was a little unfortunate. If so many capital cities, I actually don't get the capital cities over like, I mean, I get the capital cities. I get some number, I don't actually get them over like, 
I guess they don't have that many. There's three. I'm I'm engaging in a bit of hyperbole. I think it's sort of safe to say. Yeah, now I have all these emissaries and uh not super oh I can do it now. Yeah, sure. I mean, we do want to hit, probably develop something. It's probably a five, though, to be honest, and not a estate. Well, maybe a state into develop. We'll have to see, won't we? Um, Like another develop. Develop's pretty funny with this because it doesn't actually um it doesn't actually do anything that nice. Um <laughs> All it does is, uh, or it doesn't, it doesn't, um, it doesn't work well with emissary. Capital city stuff works with emissary, but the developed stuff just straight up doesn't. <clears throat> um, so they're a lot less thin than I am. I don't know if that's going to tell in the end much, but. True. Um, can counterfeit the cursed gold. Let's do that. I wonder if there's a nice three buys I can do instead of a. Something like this. Not sure. We're fortunately not anywhere near like that's nice. They had to trash the silver to move. We're not anywhere near a uh, pile out, which is good. Guess you could get a beggar here <laughs> for Puka. I don't know. I mean, you could. It, usually, that kind of stuff is awful. It's just too much actions for what you get out of it, but. <clears throat> um. Probably need to at least get a province this turn. There's going to be some nastier through multi province threats if we add additional counterfeits and stuff. You can go four into counterfeit silver at the end if you have extra drawn. <clears throat> go pretty hard here this isn't they do have the curse gold forever which mine's dead and buried um but there is so many capitals i i think i'll be honest at some point the capital city to me looks just worse than a town especially given its cost um Like the things you do with Capital City don't look that inspiring to me. Maybe I'm wrong. Um, we could get a Royal Galley down now, which is probably what we ought to do. There's like something to be said for doing like, um, 
We can even have two. I wonder if we save <clears throat> save one of those for an emissary. It's a little friendlier on the kickoff. And the town probably has some choices associated with it. Whereabouts we do this, I don't know. Junk dealer is really the ideal. I guess we can we can um Yeah, I don't know. There's multiple cards in here. Don't. So it would be cool to get the last card's an emissary. So like we want to get. We probably want to counterfeit the junk dealer. Uh, or not kind of develop the curse and develop the junk dealer is probably the play here um we may have enough to do we don't need more favors than that oh i'm like oh, it's it's okay i just have two emissaries that's a bummer. All right, I developed one and then yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, well, that's fine. I was kind of thinking, I guess we could even Royal Galley again. I don't know, play another Royal Galley. I mean, that's gonna give us a, get us a little bit lopsided may not be a problem per se but we can do this way too uh, I don't think there's much reason to okay <clears throat> this feels pretty good what are we at 10 11 I may blow up a silver to get another five. On the other hand, we have quite a bit of Royal Galley stuff coming down the line. So maybe we just go like province. Silver. I still kind of like taking silvers. They get in the way a little bit, but they're not horrible. Um... Yeah, there's no reason not to just do more of these, right? As long as we can, we can add another silver, so we can double the next one. I know we got to see what Sean Hand does. I mean, it's not clear to me what I'm gonna be able to get away with on my turn. Double may not be safe, but if double's safe, I'll just double, and then if they can't finish it, then go for. Um, you know we can counterfeit bigger things to get another double and five would be pretty good here um i mean there's dutchy dukes but the decks aren't super aren't going to hold them that well or gain them that quickly we don't have that many gains <coughs> so if i can go yeah i may go look to do like Royal Galley beggar off a develop 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 into that. Let's see where we get. I may Shanahan may Shanahan may have pretty plausible triple threat, in which case I can't double. Um don't know exactly. But I guess I can single, and then if they single again, you know. 
you both have the flexibility still to adjust, and I think quad is really a threat. <clears throat> Definitely, I think I would be in the clear without that one hand turn. But the fact that we're kind of, I think, still in it is good. Hmm. Yeah. Yeah, at some point, the f additional favors don't really mean anything. Maybe for eventually they will. They don't mean a lot in the immediate. Okay. So Shanahan can double. Assume they pick up another emissary, but maybe a puka. I don't. Are they? I didn't count the action, so maybe they needed it. Um. So I sh I shouldn't judge that capital city. Is there any way I can pile out here? And then just say no. So I probably can't double. I mean, they were at 21 counterfeiting copper. They draw and can play beggar again and they can certainly triple, I think. Um, at least it, I would be a little bit worried about that. Well, they get down just one royal galley. <clears throat> so that part of it wasn't so bad. Yeah, so I would like to get a beggar myself. And then probably go province duchy. Maybe province double duchy. I'm I'm saying that as if I know I will be able to do that, but it seems I don't I don't know, it seems possible. Um I don't know as far as develop targets, which things should be left out of deck. Probably the fours. Um, I don't know what the last. There's like a, I guess it's this, I guess it's province and a state. I mean, it can just stop, right? I can. What is the way to get the most money? Not that I want the, the state on top. But I could probably have one of them and it wouldn't be the worst thing ever. Man, this is where you have to count money. I don't want to count money. So I can whatever. This is technically a bit at the expense of having a I think. Maybe it's not. I don't even know. I just I think I could have just played through and it would have been the same money. This might be a dollar more. And they don't quote me on it. Um, I wonder if I should go beggar puka. Get another beggar. Can I threaten quad or is that totally 
nonsense. What is triple? And they can probably do a little more than triple. Triple puts them at 430. I mean, I do have the Dukes, which is uh, potentially helpful. Maybe it doesn't matter. Um, I gotta get this windows popping up. Use favor to discard. We'll do. Just do those and leave the rest. I don't know. It's scary already. Oh, wait, we do have a capital city. Okay. These windows are <laughs> just all over the place. Make these windows go away. Yeah, the, those those windows still need some fine tuning. I don't know what Severe is gonna put out here. Maybe maybe a lot. Maybe make it may become awkward. I didn't think I got enough stuff to. Maybe they're gonna pile. That would be kind of cool. If they find a pile. If they're not finding a pile, this seems kind of scary. To me. Um, maybe they can do it. I don't know what they still have unplayed as far as draw goes. If it doesn't work, I mean, if it works, props to him. If it doesn't work, I don't, I don't know that it was necessary. I don't think their position was like unwinnable. I don't know what they have left in hand though, <laughs> so maybe it just works. Now you just need $14, I guess. You get to counterfeit a gold. There you go. There you go. Very nice. All right, we'll get to watch uh, Shanahan versus Tracer for the final. I don't know who's gonna have the table, but we'll find out.
Should be Tracerus Theron. They're asking me. I don't think they can see what I wrote, so. <laughs> Oh, I forgot to do my title. It's been a blank. Oh, well. Imagine up there at the top it says, if you're watching on YouTube, of course, if you're listening on Discord. Well, you can still imagine it if you want to. Um, imagine it says Quarantine Cup 105 and those beautiful white on black letters that grace the screen so often in the videos did they get it Man. okay all right yeah all right all right <clears throat> good job they got it figured out okay what do we got what do we got island Fo oh i haven't i've been playing an island folk game on um uh on a video I don't think so Island Folk is, is pretty pretty cool it takes five favors but you can take an extra turn which is of course a very powerful effect and they have here a card which is quite good at printing favors in the form of Guildmaster though there's not villages so usefulness in that respect is somewhat limited here but there's also Ironworks Mill. I don't know. I don't know how much you actually get going here because of the ironworks aspects. That's true, Warframe. It's just like the worst village ever, but it can do it. I'm af I'm afraid they just don't have time to get anywhere. Probably Young Witch isn't super important just because of Guardian. And like a reasonably okay bane pile. Um, pretty nice 5 2. Guildmaster is nice here. You get a hunter. That seems reasonable. I guess what you do here is you go into the. You're doing ironworks mill stuff, and then you can get hunters, and then they can draw the mills, and that's pretty nice. Possibly. Like, I mean, if you have a, if you have all the ironworks, that's pretty good, or all the mills. I mean, that'd be pretty good. Probably Tracer just gets a hunter here. But you might take a storyteller form. Yeah. I mean, at some point, Your storytellers in your forums probably look as good as it depends on deck composition, I guess, a little bit. I don't know how much you muck around with voyaging. Apparently, according to Tracer, some that's kind of a weird order there, right? To play the ironworks before the hunter, you might as well know what you're gonna get off the hunter first. Um, it's probably pretty inconsequential, but kind of a strange order there. But if you're just clicking stuff, you know, these things happen. Shanahan approaching. I wonder if it's worth getting a contract just so you can have a guild master in play while you do some of the ironworks stuff still kind of hard to think about when you want to actually do this so tracer's going with the get one voyage and then get out strat i guess you can also sunken treasure stuff post guild master yeah 
It's true. The favors being part of island folk make the contract favor look more appealing to. Shanahan's just going to not trigger this, I assume. There's no real reason to. Probably taking, going ahead and taking their island folk turn just right off the bat. There's not. Well, yeah, I mean, as long as they're still trying to, like, say, race down the mills, there's not really a good reason not to just island folk right off. Terrible hunter. Hunter is the worst card. Great hunter. Okay, it's split the difference. One awful hunter, one good hunter. Actually, really, the awful hunter was fine, too. It just wasn't that friendly. You would have liked to have the ironworks, of course. <clears throat> Hitting, uh, like, 9 and 10 here is is really huge as far as the favor stuff goes, just because the form's so nice for that. Shanahan does dip into the contracts. I'm not totally convinced by it, but... Uh, I don't agree, but... I think it's kind of terrible, but it's not terrible, terrible. Just certainly, to me, pretty weak. Shanahan could go form Guardian to take another Island Folk turn right now. I don't know if that's worth it, but something they could do. Oh, that was Tracer. Never mind. I'm just confused <laughs> about his turn it is. Tracer got two oranges. Oh, right. Tracer is did the... Uh, Oh, did he do anything trick or tricky? Not especially. I'm not sure what Shanahan's referring to there, but... Yeah, it might it might be that Warfront. I just kind of would expect Shanahan to have already encountered that. If it were someone else, you know, but Shanahan, he's so seemingly engaged. I I just would have thought he might have encountered it. But it could totally be that. Tracer can't, now Tracer's Voyages now don't do anything. Um, he can't play them on the Island Folk turn and get any benefit. I went all the way back. Hmm. That's a little weird after seeing the Voyage in hand. That's pretty far. I mean, and you know, I don't want to. I don't want to sit in judgment of any undoes. <laughs> That's a lot of. I don't want to bring any heat down on anything. 
At some point, you got to just be like, well, I guess I'm going to buy provinces. They're a pretty good card here. Oh, I see what you're saying, Mr. Guy. Oh, uh, right, because it's, it's your cleanup happens. Okay, okay. You guys are right. Never mind, I take it all back. I take everything back. I'm sorry, Tracer. Yes. No, we don't, DZ. We need far, far fewer. I don't know what they're doing. I mean, I don't know what I would be doing. I don't really know. I don't know how much you're getting out of extra stuff versus buying provinces at some point. Seems a little wheel spinny. I guess getting to 13 is pretty nice. Like here, we, I mean, the contract doesn't even have a target. That's sort of sad. They're just going to end up running the estates. If you're not, I guess. That order was weird to me too. It's really you play the distant shore first, but. <clears throat> Look at all these mills. Then what is going to happen? I guess you can like gain a young witch with this ironworks if you're Shanahan. And then Tracer probably isn't like super, can't super easily get a guardian at this stage. Otherwise the ironworks can take a state I suppose. Well, now the old maps are sitting there so maybe those but. Oh, it's still Shanahan. What did Shanahan take? It's still I keep missing when it's Island Folks versus where it switched to the other person. They just took a state. Okay. I guess that's fine. Um. Yeah, if they keep playing these distant shores and the ironworks on, they're going to hit. They're going to hit a point of. Um, 
Yes, that's correct. Kubu. So yeah, I mean, they, Tracer has other ways of blocking it, for sure. Probably the estates and forms are going to run, though. I don't know if Tracer can, like, do them in this sequence of turns. And probably needs, would need empty estates by province and two forums. With Way the Rat, actually. I guess it's the uh, estates that are maybe going to be the tough ones, actually. The estates. These have the. I don't know. I don't know who has two distant shores. If it's Tracer, then maybe Tracer can get it. I don't know if Tracer will get to. Enough money here. Yeah, he doesn't. I guess you can try it with a contracted ironworks. Huh, just takes that. I would have contracted the ironworks, I think, for sure, but. <clears throat> So that seemed kind of weird to me. This is the good turn. Like, you could have still gained the old map, and then you could have had plus action for more, like, rats in here. Which maybe you don't need, because you're just going to get to $10 anyway. And then you just have to be able to... I guess if you get to $12, then also you just already won. So this isn't it in hand, actually. I think I think people were too slow to go for um, uh, provinces there. But that being said, it's only turn 12, so... Maybe, maybe I'm wrong. But anyway, that was a really interesting board. Um, and then I don't know what Shanahan is specifically confused about, but anyway, thank you for watching. Congratulations to Tracer for winning yet another Quarantine Cup. And I will catch you all another time. See ya.